So first of all, we're going to make the shortbread base. Three, two, one method, straight in the food processor till it resembles breadcrumbs. Then put one spoon in each of your little moulds. Now you can do this in a big tray if you want. Okay, so this is just for the, some nice individual ones. There you go, I'll get even faster at it as we go along. Then you're going to press all of this down and we're going to bake that 160 degrees for 20 minutes. Now in a pan you're going to need sugar, lemon zest, corn flour and then we're going to gradually combine 250 mils of water to that. Then you want to put that on a low heat and gradually bring it to the ball, stirring all the time until it thickens up. It's going to be like a thick custard. Then leave that to go cold. Meanwhile, your shortbread is golden brown and out of the oven. So once your lemon glue, I call this, is nice and cold, then start to add your egg yolks. Then after that, you are going to add... 150 mils of lemon juice. This is about three to four lemons, okay? And as you can see, it is now resembling something that is vaguely edible. We're going to pop that in on top of our shortbread. So just a good spoonful into there, or line the bottom of your dish with your lemon meringue mixture. Even it off and then we're ready to get that back in the oven for 15 minutes. While that's all going on, let's make the meringue. So we've got four egg whites here. Start whisking that up. Once it's started to aerate, then you're going to gradually add 200 grams of sugar into it till it comes up to stiff peaks. There you go. Now, let's get that on top of that lemon mixture with that crispy base. Oh, my mouth's watering just thinking about it. Dollop it, pipe it, quinelle it, rondelle it, do whatever you like. And then get it back into the oven for another 20 minutes. And look at that. Crispy, crunchy, mmm, lovely. And don't forget to click and subscribe to Wascooks. Cheers, thank you.